Today we're going to take a brief look at the return to home fail safe fly home height. When you turn the DJI remote off or it loses range, the Phantom goes into a clever fail safe mode and flies back to your home point via GPS. It's a pretty clever function. The DJI manuals clearly point out that when this function is activated, the Phantom will hover for 3 seconds, fly to around 60 feet, turn around and fly back to the home point. And this is great, providing there are no trees or buildings uh, above 60 feet along the way. In our experience, one of the things DJI don't seem to mention is that if the Phantom is actually flying higher than 60 feet, say at 300 feet at the time, then that's the height she'll fly home at. And in my mind, this is a fantastic feature and one that we use all the time for a bunch of reasons. So if that scary moment comes and you've lost sight of your Phantom and it's time to enter the failsafe mode, or you think she's about to go there all by herself, my advice is to hit the Phantom up lever and pump in a heap more height before you switch over to failsafe. At least that way you know she's flying high and clear of pretty much any obstacles even if you can't see it anymore. This is a great little trick we use all the time when we're in areas like a forest or something with large obstacles and we want the Phantom to be able to fly home and land herself in a clearing when we've lost sight of her. Then of course when the Phantom finally appears back overhead you can take control again by using the attitude position on the Phantom remote. The response is the same for both the Phantom and the Phantom 2 in our tests. Another thing to bear in mind with the height settings is that when you fire up the Phantom and she sets her home position, it will also record altitude. So if you set your home position on top of a high-rise building or a mountain, she'll fly home 60 feet above that point all the way. So if you were to set your home position in, say, a valley and then climb back up to the top uh, and then switch to failsafe, she'll stay at whatever height you're flying at, no matter how low or high, until she reaches the home target and then begin her descent. So it's really important to always set your home position on a flat area or slightly elevated position with a big clearing and a clear flight path all the way home no matter where you're uh, flying. We tried these functions out on the Phantom and the Phantom 2 and it's the exactly the same response for both. So please check out our other Phantom tips, tricks and comparisons as we discover things. We'll try and post them online and happy flying.